okay, when I was like 15, I went to the beach with my cousin, and I went with his mom's side of the family, and like we share the dad's side of the family, so his grandma is not my grandma, so whatever, right? We're at the beach with his grandma and his like mom and whatever, so we're like there, and the rooms are his mom and dad, his sisters in one room, and then his grandma, him, and me in one room, so like we have two rooms, so it's like, I don't know, midnight, maybe a little after midnight, and his grandma's asleep. Oh, and we also only have one room key because there's only supposed to be one person in the room. <laughs> Anyways, so there's only one room key, right? And it's in his grandma's room asleep. Like, his grandma's asleep with the key in there. So we're like, well, we're trying to go down to the hot tub, but uh, we can't really, like, just go ask his grandma for the key because she's asleep. And technically, the pool closes at 11. So we're like, how can we get the key? And so my cousin walks over to her room, right? He slowly creeps that door open. He's like, all right, well, she's asleep, but... We're going to be, like, really stealthy to get in there. So we, like, push the room like Rainbow Six. We're, like, checking all the corners and everything. We're, like, sneaking up. My cousin walks up. The key is on the uh, nightstand, right? So it's right next to his grandma's head. He, like, sneaks up. I don't know how he didn't wake her up because she's a super light sleeper. Sneaks up, grabs it, just sprints out, right? He's out of there. He's gone. So he runs to me. We shut the door. We open the front door very slowly. Then, you know, we run down, we get in the hot tub, and we just, well, we really just sat in the hot tub for like an hour. We didn't really do anything. But, so we're like, all right, you know, let's go back, because it is like negative 17 degrees outside. There's like snow, there's icicles, there's polar bears, there's the Yeti running around. So we're like, all right, well, it's time to go back. So we hop up, and we go back to the, our room. We open the door, we notice his grandma's door is now open. We left it closed. So we're like, um, what happened here? So we like, rainbow peek our way through the room. His grandma's still asleep, but we're like, we shut that door, right? I'm like, yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. So my cousin has to like, basically he like slithers in like a snake, puts the key back, slithers out. And like, so we're done. Like we're dried off. We're just sitting in the bed. We're like, why is the door open? And we freaked out for like two hours. We're like, we couldn't figure it out. Couldn't figure out what happened, and we're like, she had to wake up, right? But if she woke up, she wouldn't have gone back to sleep when she saw we weren't there. So we're, we're just like, we can't figure it out. We go to sleep, we wake up the next morning, and his grandma's like, where were you guys last night? We're like, what? She's like, I came out here, and you guys weren't here. We're like, uh, uh, no, we were here. She's like, really? We're like, yeah. She's like, huh. I don't know, I didn't really come in here, it was dark, but like, I didn't, I thought I didn't see you guys. We're like, no, we were here. She's like, oh, all right, whatever, and just walked away. She went back into her room, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. GG.